What's up guys? Yoshi here. Welcome back to some more FFT. Uh, we just finished the gate of Rio Bane's castle, so now we're inside. But uh, it's going to be tricky. Because if our opponent goes before us, then we're going to get hit pretty hard. Um, normally I'd take blade grasp, but... I need to try something else. Um, regenerator? Hmm. Something that has a good speed save would be okay. It's plus one speed when you get hit. Critical quick would be nice. If it ever triggered. You have to be terminal though. MP restore, no. Used MP, no. Counter flood, no. Oops. Dragon spirit protection from death? Maybe? I don't know if I've ever seen this proc. Maybe we'll try it here. I have to read this again, is it? So any physical attack adds raise? Okay, we'll try it out. Two swords. Let's see. Yeah, her blade grasp isn't going to work in this fight either. Do we not have... Oh yeah, here it is. Counter magic. And I guess we'll... Uh, we'll... Give this a go. I mean, if he gets the first hit, it's not going to be good. Try and move him in the back. Maybe that helps. Let's spread them out just in case there's a nasty AoE coming our way. I kind of wish I didn't sell my uh, my quick, my speed up in gear like that. I don't know if I actually had a green beret. I saw it in the shop, but I never bought it. He's a monk. He's not using his sword. <laughs> All the dead bodies vanish. Okay, so his starting location doesn't even matter of the story, they just throw them in the front anyway. Ouch. 140. That is pretty brutal. Man, 
he's got a lot of uh, a lot of HP. If I can get behind him, then I'll go and attack him. But um, I'll try yelling. I'm gonna hope that my dragon spirit hooks me up. again. Get that speed boost. And if I would have known that, I would have just uh, uh, just went and uh, moved closer to him so I could get behind him on the second turn, but too late for that now. I'm trying to yell again. <clears throat> Stinks, he's like in the middle here. I don't he's gonna be able to reach me no matter what. <clears throat> Come on, dragon spirit. Yeah, help me out here. Nope. Nothing. <laughs> Alright, we'll head back. Um, let's see. So this doesn't work. Hide by becoming invisible. Our generator won't heal me enough. If I can dodge his sword skills. Maybe we just got unlucky and it didn't... Well, it's not really a physical attack, right? So... I don't know what invisible will do. But we'll try it. Keep them with counter magic for the second part of the fight. Um, okay, let's head back in. We might be okay, so if we head in and yell, we should get a second turn and then I'll get behind him and attack. I'll keep this the way it was before. through this uh, narrative real quick. This is a really tough fight. When I first played through this, it took me a long time to figure out some kind of weird strategy to get past it. Because what really stinks is you save the game right before this, so it's not like you can go back and level up some more or go get some new gear. You're kind of stuck. So you can get really screwed over here. You gotta pull some kind of crazy strategy. Here, I'm gonna yell right in his ear. <laughs> Go again, and hopefully, he does enough damage. Otherwise, we are dead in the water. 160? It's not enough damage. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Secret fist? 
Yeah, this sentence is too slow. Well. So that's not a strategy that we can use. Um, what do we have here? Abandon or sunken state? I'll try sunken state. Um, da -da 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 -da. however, we can improve his damage a little bit, right? By one. Yeah, I don't have that, uh, the $50,000 gauntlet thing that increases our damage, physical damage by three. But we can try this. So we don't need to move one extra space. Um, we just need to do enough damage. <laughs> So that he will die for sure in one attack. I think there is uh, another strategy I came up with in the past where you made him a ninja and you gave him a bunch of like speed enhancing gear like the helmet and the armor maybe the accessory and you get to go first and so immediately I think I gave him guts as well you just kind of run around the room and you have move plus three on. I think I had that. I really grinded pretty far. And you keep upping your speed until you got to the point where you had like three or more turns in a row and you could just go in and just hammer him with your two swords ability to finish him off. Man, that thing is not triggering. Okay, so we'll do the same thing here. Move up. Yell. Hopefully with that one attack power he's gained sufficient damage. Wow. Just one point changed it to 198. And it's 100%. We got it. All right, first part is over. Whew. see these like archaic demons or whatever they're called for the first time they got some like nasty dark holy magic <clears throat> so if we can just focus down Belius we should be okay oh that's weird he gets to go first ooh and I get to go twice It doesn't matter if we die, so I'm not going to bother healing. 
I'm gonna go and attack from the front. Nice. And go again. I'm gonna attack from the side. Wow, he's still alive. It's almost... It's like, what, 8 points under 800 HP. So if he does have 800 HP, just one more attack will kill him. But we got everyone else to uh, to work with here. Agrius. Um, we can't reach Velius right now. But... Holy Explosion causes confusion. Let me see how much damage it does. 60 and 90 damage? It might be better to... Uh, yeah. Try and silence them. That'll help us. Hey! Double silence! <laughs> Dang! Oh wow, she's like... Way far away. Um, let's check out the summon timing. Four, so Tuki will get to go. Which one is that? This guy on the left. He is not silenced, so that's interesting. One, two, three, four, five. Let's try that. Nice. Okay, we should be able to take out these guys then. Do a little uh, Cyclops action. Tuki's gonna move away for sure. One, two, three, four, five. Huh. Velius doesn't get to go for a little while, right? Okay, so this will get through before. So that means we can kind of put it here. One, two, three, four. Let's see if we get lucky. Yes! Alright, Cyclops action. It's for Liza. I don't think we need Liza, but move her here. Or try to, at least. <laughs> we'll just wait. Oh, wow. Okay, Whew. I thought that was going to come out immediately. It's like, that's going to kill her. Turn to little statues. Alright, see if this will do the job. We got him. Whew. Powering up, he's like, yeah, this explodes. Crazy battle out of the way.
It's interesting. So, Islude was talking about Vormav transforming into a monster, but Alma said Wygraf was a monster. If it's because it's Alma or if it's because of the stone. But I mean, wouldn't it have reacted with Islude while he was holding it? Oh, she dropped it. Hmm. There's a fight on the rooftop. I totally forgot about that. Um, I don't think this is really going to matter. I'll just go back to Blade Grasp. Honestly, when they get hit by magic, they just die. I know at least Liza knows Blade Grasp, so. Ninja. That's okay. I'll just keep counter magic on. Unless there's something that'll. Yeah, maybe critical quick would be okay. If they do somehow manage to stay alive. Do that. That's yeah, more important. Um, but I do like Blade Grasp better than Critical Quick. It's more consistent. I mean, it won't work for magic attacks and whatnot, but. Holy Knight is almost finished here. I wonder if her stuff goes off for physical attack. I mean, God, the, her damage is terrible. Her physical attack power, anyway. I'll have to get her, like, move plus two. And, uh, give her some physical attack power so she can contribute more. Who has the diamond? Oh, here we go. See, his physical attack power is nice, so... Now that that weird fight is over, we'll give her back her diamond armlet. I think her sword skill goes off of physical attack power, though. So we definitely need to purchase that... that one accessory after this. But, uh... Uh, let's see. I'm wondering if we should uh, keep going. It's a 25 minute video. Mm. What the hey? Let's go into it. Because I know this upcoming battle is going to finish off the chapter. So it's better to do it like this. It's more complete. Oh, we can only have four people this time. Mm. Uh, let's see. Do we want three wizards or two wizards and a holy knight? I feel like on this one we need some mobility. It's a weird position, so we'll just go all all wizard. 
Agrius can take a knee on this one. I think for her to be more relevant, um, yeah, I'll definitely buy that accessory for her to do extra damage. But we're gonna have to get her some some serious grindage going on for thief skill to get move plus two. But we can work on that off camera. Took you out of the garbage. No, she could use a sword. Yeah, ha, ha. Protect Rafa? I think if we just get one of them low on HP, then we should be okay. The fight will be over. Jesus. Hope she doesn't die here. Okay, 90. Run! What is she doing? <laughs> what in the world? Oh, that is so dirty. 100% chance to stop somebody. Um, I think we can target... Let's see if I can chase her down. No, I can't reach her. What I can do is do a little chakra action. Keep her alive for longer. Actually, I just want to hit Elmdor. Oh, he's got Hamedo. If that triggers, he'll just hit me first and cancel my attack. So I can't really go after him. We'll do chakra for now. That's okay. Ultima? I wonder if I can move right next to her. One, two, three. It's one height difference. I don't know if that'll hit her or not. Or if it's... Hmm. Um, I'm 
wondering. Oh no, it's the main character that can learn Ultima if he gets hit by it. I think he has to be a squire though. This is gonna hurt. I don't think there's something that. Because we can't reflect Ultima, can we? Eight percent chance. Try it. Why not? Otherwise, we're gonna load up on Cyclops just in case that doesn't work out. Three oh four. better. I'm just curious. Come on, reflect. Yes, we got it. Now to see if Ultima can be reflected. Uh, I guess not. But at least you got hit by it. Now ah, she's toast. See ya. <laughs> Retreat, she's already dead. Battle's not too difficult, it's just a little tricky. I think once you learn that you don't need to kill all of them, and you just focus on one person, it should be okay. stone that is. <clears throat> this is something to do with kind of a uh, reacts to or it amplifies the person's kind of persona or spirit. So I guess it could tell that he was good on the inside. Somebody called me. Imagine if they just missed that stone.
I think it would be cool if uh, if Ramza holds onto a stone, and if he dies in battle, he just gets resurrected once. <laughs> Slow down the text, it's going too fast. Problem. Yeah, she's equipped with a rod, not a sword. <clears throat> we'll add her to the party just to have her. Probably won't use her or her brother. I'll just snatch up their gear though. Chapter 4, finally. Sounds like Orlando's music. Super righteous. Yep. Yeah. Why, but Orlando reminds me of like Obi Wan Kenobi, Star Wars, A New Hope. <clears throat> Don't 
Tagola Pass, Bravenia Free City, Finneth or Finneth River, and Zeltenia Castle. Rio Veins has a shop. Interesting. Assassin Dagger at Death Sentence. That's okay. Oh, wow. So that's what we missed. So we had Diamond Sword for 10 damage. Platinum did 12. Now we have Ice Brand. 13. But it's Ice Elemental. Okay, nothing too crazy here. Thirty-seven, ten, thirty-four, fifteen. I don't know. I like the Aegis, the Magic Dodge. It's really good. Circlet. It's good for uh, our knights. I guess we only sell knight stuff here. Yeah, might have been able to use those in the in the duel with Wygriff. There's that Bracer. Physical plus three. Ah, it's, it's always re-raise. That's interesting. I'll buy one of these. God, they're so expensive though. Whew. Everything but the shield. Let's see how much that costs. Holy moly. Um we're good here. Oh, actually. I can learn scream now. Brave speed magic attack power by shouting. It's only on himself, right? Yeah. Nice. And you can see it's not mastered yet because uh, there's some hidden stuff like Ultima I think he can learn. He just has to get hit by it. I don't remember if it has to be a squire or not when he gets hit by it. But he does have to get hit by it and survive. take off their stuff. Anything we don't use, we'll sell, get some cash. Wizard's good. Good. Yeah, we definitely we don't need to master this or get equip backs for that matter. Um... See, to get more movement, we need Thief, which needs Archer. That's gonna be weird. It's gonna take her forever because. Oh, we just bought her all that gear, too. So we'll go Archer. Give her. Feels so silly. Should we really make her an archer and give her gain JP up? Or give her equip sword? Uh, wait a second. She can equip sword. <gasps> Let's go to the shop. Do we want to do that? Yeah, we have to get her a bow. And these things are so weak. 
I'll just get the wind slash. Man, we're broke again. I guess we can go around and sell stuff, but. The question is what do we give her for a <clears throat> secondary ability? Um, we don't need to save archer job points. We just need to reach like level two or something. So we could give her charge plus one. Oh yeah, she is the archer. I guess we'll just have to keep item. Keep gain GP up, JP up. Um, I guess we don't really need to do a whole lot of damage. So for now, she just needs some movement. We'll just give her some Germanist boots. Make sure she can get into position and hit somebody so she can get some JP. But the anywho. I'm going to save it there. And we'll probably do a bit of uh, leveling up, some grinding. Get Agrius in a better position. But, uh, yeah. So we'll wrap it up there. Um, yeah, hit the like button, leave a comment, subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.